but these cycles and boundaries are necessary for the existence of physical reality. If you want to appease Saturn, you have to look at death and the endings of cycles as something necessary and beautiful. You have to be grateful for your limitations and obstacles as well. That they provide you um, a challenge to... I mean, if everything was really easy, it would be boring. How could you have success without there being a boundary between one space and the next? A line to cross. And because Saturn rules these things and structure, boundaries and structure, it's really, really key on physical structure. Um, organization and structure should be the first things you consider in anything that you're doing. You got to get organized. Saturn's the first planet you need to make sure you have on your side. You look at the homes of any of the elite and their homes are very well organized and structured. Compare that to somebody who is very disorganized with a bunch of clutter. We talked about how a cluttered home and environment is evidence of a cluttered mind, a cluttered subconscious. How are you going to have things getting through and have communication with your subconscious if everything's cluttered? Saturn is the heaviest of all the planets. Its metal is lead. The densest, heaviest metal there is. It's so dense that even radiation cannot go through it. You know why heavy metal is the hardest music? <laughs> it's dealing with Saturn and Mars. If you get into black metal, that's strictly Saturn. That's the heaviest you can get. <laughs>